before I came to prison, I was an addict and I some, used to do crack and I was a actually a drug dealer at the same time. I used to sell drugs so I could keep up my habit, but to keep up my lifestyle as well. Because of being a transgender, that's a kind of little, you know, it's a little dispensive being a woman. Well, I was in by myself as a woman, I mean, on the street. I mean, in here, they of course, they, they just consider me just a male because I, was, I haven't had any sex, any operations or anything. But I consider myself a woman. I mean, I've been a transgender since I was 14. I met someone while I got here, and I didn't think that that... Was, I didn't come here for that. I came here just to do my little time and thing. But I actually, um, I guess, fell into something with somebody, and it's actually quite serious. I was 19 years old when I first got incarcerated. I killed somebody when I was 19 years old. And I've, I've been incarcerated like 27 years now. Is this your first relationship with a transgender person? Um, it's my first relationship with her. I met her. I found I found something in her that um, that was unique, and that's happened to be a name, unique and special. I'm very excited about this relationship. Uh, I mean, right now it's, just, it's very special. You know, uh, I plan on taking this to the streets. You know.